So welcome back. So this time we will talk about binomial factoring. Then let me ask you one question. So what does binomial mean? In mathematics, monomial means one term, binomial two terms, trinomial three terms, and four or more than four terms we always call polynomials. So this time we will talk about Binomial factoring, which means the polynomial has only two terms. The most typical binomial factoring form is usually a squared minus b squared. So any polynomial has this form, then you can make factorings a plus b times a minus b. Okay, let's look at a few examples. One example, maybe x squared minus 4. Then x squared minus 4, you can rewrite it x squared minus 2 squared. So, this form looks like a squared minus b squared. We can say a become x, b become 2 here. Therefore, you can make a factoring x plus 2, x minus 2. Okay, look at one more example. Maybe 4a squared minus 25b squared this time. Now, can you make 4a squared as a something square? Yes, you can make this as 2a squared. What about 25b squared? Yeah, this become 5b squared, right? Therefore, you can factor in this one 2a minus 5b and then 2a plus 5b. You may wonder why I wrote down the first one x plus 2, x minus 2. But now second time 2a minus 5b and then 2a plus 5b. But because um, multiplication is commutative, so you can switch them. So even though you write 2a plus 5b and then 2a minus 5b, they are also correct answer. Okay? Let's think, think about these two questions. If possible, please pause this video for a second and then factor in these two questions and come back, please. Now, number one. So 49x squared minus 64y squared. Like before, we want to make 49x squared as something squared. Also 64y squared as well. Can you think can you think what can be what can be 49x squared? Yeah, if you think this is 7x square then that is correct now the second term becomes 8 y square okay then now we complete a square minus b square form so now we are ready to factoring so this becomes 7x plus 8y and then 7x minus 8y Again, even though you write 7x minus ay times 7x plus ay, they also correct answer. So don't worry about that. What about number two? Okay, so please let me know whether you get this one as 3t square and then 6 square so that you get the answer 3t plus 6 so let me rewrite it because it's not clear to me so 3t plus 6 and then 3t minus 6 if you get this answer I have to say it is not right because binomial factoring especially square term factoring this sign must be minus if it is positive, it is not factorable. Therefore, 9t squared plus 
36 is already prime terms. Okay, so I'm going to say prime. So please don't forget that. Okay, the square binomial factoring form we always do minus sign only, not plus one. Okay.